warm greeting to one and all. Dear students, in the today's session, we will discuss about a device and platform that you need to follow for appearing online examination. So when we are talking about the devices, it may be laptop, desktop, iPad, smartphone or tab, no issue. You can use any one of these devices in order to appear for the examination. When we are talking about the examination, online examination, make sure that you have a better internet connectivity. A speed of 512 kbps or more is good during your examination. And for PC users, make sure that they have sufficient power supplies. And for the mobile user, make sure that your mobile has been well charged and you have a battery power backup. When you are talking about a platform, especially for the PC user, make sure that you have installed the latest Windows operating system on your PC with a minimum 512 MB RAM. Okay, and for the better performance, make sure that you have at least 2 GB or more. And make sure again, you have made your Google Chrome as your default browser during your examination period. Okay, if it has been not installed, make sure to install it on your mobile as well as on your PC. For mobile users, they can download it from the Google Play Store. And for the PC users, I am going to provide this particular link on the description part from where you will be able to download the latest Google Chrome. Now, the important note regarding the browser. As soon as you are going to start the, your examination by clicking on the link that you received from the university, it will automatically open your examination paper on the browser. Okay, so make sure that there is a only one tab is open during the examination period. Okay, it means don't try to open another tab since it may delay or it may degrade the performance of your entire system. So don't try to open more than one website when your examination is running because by mistakenly if you have click or close down the link of your examination tab then you may face a lot of problem. Don't try to open another website during the examination period. Turn off all the notifications of your that you are going to get from the various social apps. It may be WhatsApp, it may be Instagram, it may be FB or any other social networking site. So turn off all those notifications since it is going to distract you a lot and it might be possible that your examination may get terminated because of all these notifications. Okay, so make sure to turn off all the notifications. Now how to turn off? For that purpose, the tip has been given over here. I am going to provide all these tips on a description part from where you will be able to turn off this notification. Similarly, for the mobile user, Make sure that your mobile in the DND mode, that is do not disturb mode. And again, how to turn off these notifications, I am going to provide this step on the description part from where you will be able to turn off all the notifications. Then, university is going to conduct a mock test, so appear for this particular demo test or trial test in order to check and the working of your entire devices and the platform. Okay, and if any issues that you may come across during the examination, don't forget to contact your college authority or university authority and report them the problem that you have faced. Okay, with that all the best for your examination.